It's amazing to meet you. It is simply extraordinary. Maybe this will all make sense if I explain who I am. My name is Dr. Ellie Staple, and I'm a psychiatrist. My work concerns a particular type of delusion of grandeur. It's a growing field. I specialize in those individuals who believe they are superheroes. <laughs> Good for you. The three of you have convinced yourselves you have extraordinary gifts like something out of a comic book. David Dunn, the only person to survive that train wreck all those years ago. What do you do? I'm in security. You think you have superpowers? It's a feeling. Vision. I have to touch them. You believe you are a protector. My name is Patricia. I just finished really seeing it glass and it was amazing. But I remember I saw Unbreakable years back, but I lost track of the movie. But seeing this one now, yeah, I caught up. Then I saw Splits of Days ago and I was saying, amazing movie, mind you. Uh, I think you guys should see the movie. That's all I can say. He had his movements, he was slow, but he picked up and it was about my time. You guys should see glass. The movie is thrilling, like, um, ah. Comes across the mind of human, the things that play around in the mind of the human beings beyond what you can think of at the time. It's a very thrilling movie, I'll just say. Um, I'd say the movie actually really blew my mind. Like, it was so triggering and it was so great. Like, it really There are a whole lot of like, experiences like, okay, say about those people trying to, they think they are helping, but in the actual sense of it, they are really not helping. They just like, okay, trust nobody with the old sense of being That was, yeah, that was how I say about this experience. Um, if I'm to relate it to what is happening in society, I would say, while it is, um, okay, it's actually related to what is happening in society because, um, we have some people that are trying their best to make sure they, they, they put in place balance by silencing some people for the sake of greater good, as soon to say. That's just basically so what, what I think I saw that played out in that scenario. In relation to things happening in society now, I feel like we should not judge people. Yeah, those characters were judged and they, were, they, they had a lot of talents and they tried to like play down their talent. They should also not undermine people. See what happened to the um, lady with glass or Mr. Glass. I was respecting him, says Mr. Glass. And that's what he undermined him at the end of the day. He still won, he was the biggest hero. So don't undermine people and don't judge people. About cinematography, like I said, anyway, what is in the front here? Yeah, so the whole effect of the city moving and the wind blowing, really. Lightning was okay, um, and the sound. The sound was on point. I think yeah, I'll, I'll give it eight. Cinematography and direction of the movie. Ah, I won't lie. When it got to like near the end, I was upset. I was like, "Will this movie end like this?" I'm just insulting the movie. It looks cheap, all rubbish. And the next thing, director just blew my mind away. What I didn't expect. He just brought out another scene from nowhere. I'm like, okay, okay, cool, cool. It played in my mind. I couldn't. I, I felt like it was almost like a Nollywood. So let's say. Yeah, in Hollywood movie because I was like, okay, I can't predict it. But at the end, and nah, 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 still, hopefully. But there was a part they made a mistake. I think I didn't see when it was when Kevin was the face so, of the away, Mr. Glass, and he had no trousers on. The next thing, you lose him away, change it to the base, and bam, trousers on. Still, was still, still a good movie. And it was actually very nice. Um, okay, it got to a point that I actually was like, it was like, but I guess it was because of what we watch it, that's why it was like that, but it's nice, it was actually okay. 4DX experience. In other words, when you say 4DX experience, they are not lying. 
time is free, you have to experience it. Guys, they are moving the cars, my seat is checking that the vibration. I'm telling you, as they, they are fighting, and you're like, oh, let me advise you, you have, they are not strong, my dear. You're pregnant. <laughs> Don't try for this, but no, it's an experience. It's an experience. 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 I cannot explain the experience. The experience. The experience. For this experience, awesome. Um, I think here we have a little bit of um, weather, like the wind. We have um, we have some form of lightning. Then a lot of vibration. So. <laughs> oh my God, that's mind blowing. Um, I actually feel. Um, the man of the future moving and the vibration of everything. Wow. Yeah, the lightning too actually feels sexy. Yeah, so it's good. The experience of us.